and we continue our team coverage of the heat. Let's go to News Channel reporter Dave Alley. He is live in Santa Maria with how firefighters there are on standby tonight. Dave. Well, they certainly are, CJ. The air tanker base located here at the Santa Maria Airport. It is a vital tool in fighting wildfires, not only right here on the Central Coast, but also far beyond. And right now, with the threat of wildfires at an extreme level, that base is on high alert. Temperatures are on the rise, putting the Santa Maria Air Tanker Base on high alert. The forecast is uh, for some unprecedented uh, heat, which uh, can create some extreme fire behavior. So the readiness of the base is being ratcheted up. Extra hours, there's some extra uh, base personnel, uh, parking tenders, uh, dispatchers, so forth, all the, all the things that happen behind the scenes. This week, two aircraft have been positioned in Santa Maria. A Type 1 air tanker and a Type 1 helicopter, uh, in addition to uh, the fuelers and the, um, the folks that, that uh, mix and, and pump retardant. And Thursday morning, another addition, a DC-10 flew in from San Bernardino. The Santa Maria uh, reload base um, supports upwards of about 3 million acres. Should we get a new start with this uh, unprecedented weather conditions, we're ready to uh, support. With the heightened awareness, everyone at the base knows their support could be needed at any second. We try to make sure we stay a little bit more vigilant, make sure we're actually here ready in case something happens. You know, we want to be ready to go at any at a moment's notice. Crew members have already been working hard here at the tanker base this week, having responded to a pair of fires in Southern California on Wednesday. Went and flew a couple of uh, drops over on the fire outside of the uh, Los Angeles area and then got diverted from that one down to one on the uh, southern border between here and Mexico. And the base had its small spotter plane also uh, leave this morning and take off to that fire, the route fire down in Castaic. Now, with the heat expected to last for many days, the folks here, the workers here, know that they are they're going to be in for the long haul, not just during this heat wave, but also as fire conditions uh, continue to to be at an extreme level. Uh, again, not just for the next week or so, but also for many weeks and many more months to come. Reporting in Santa Maria, I'm News Channel reporter Dave Alley. All right, thank you, Dave.